Okay, Beaverton Nazarene Church, chiller filling procedure. Go into this mechanical room, which is uh, kind of next to where that chiller thing looks like a big radiator out there inside the fenced enclosure. That's the chiller. We're gonna go in here and fill it up with water in this mechanical room. Because it's been drained all winter, so it wouldn't freeze and cause all kinds of nasty, expensive problems. So what you do is you turn this valve right here. There's the boiler there, see? All that contraption. Don't worry about those, those should be okay. But this one right here, it says chiller, chiller tower water fill, do not use. Well, you have to use it if you're gonna fill it up. We used it last fall to shut it off. This just starts the water flowing to the chiller. Okay, now you go over here, behind this thing, and you flip this chiller pump switch on, like that, and that's ready to go. Any monkey can do this. You're in here. Oh dear. Oh, well, first you make sure that there's a padlock on the switch in the mechanical room back there so that nobody can turn this furnace on while you're in here. It gets real noisy and ugly if they do. Supply fan, that looks good. Anything else in here? Yeah, chiller pump. There's another one right there. Okay. I think that's all we need to do there. Except now, you got some little uh, deals here. Need to make sure those are closed. Little drain spigot, gizmos. There's one. There's two. I guess that's it. And there's some more up there. So I'm gonna go up there and up there and make sure they're closed. Okay, then you crawl up to the top here, see? And you check these two, that one and that one. I put a screwdriver on there. Make sure a little stubby works pretty good. Flat blade stubby. And you just make sure the light's pretty good for this track too. And there's some up here. Make sure those are tight. That one is. Make sure that one's tight. It is. So those are all off. That means that when this tower fills up, that it won't be leaking. You have to open those up and drain them in the fall. So this thing won't freeze up and break in the cold weather because there's no insulation in here other than them bricks. Okay, I'll see if I can get down without killing myself here. Yeah? around with this thing for a while. I'm gonna prop this door open so I can get back in. You can see that this is all locked up out here, so there's no way to get in. Let's of course you. Once you push it open like that. Now over here, that's not supposed to be here. Oh dear. And there's a valve down here that we need to shut off. Oh, they already shut it off. Okay. It's off. That's the main thing. Make sure that's off because it that's how you drain the chiller once you shut the water supply off. And if it's open why 
it'll never get full, which means it'll never turn on. It'll just be wasting water all summer. So, don't do that. This here is where we... in his mechanical room here where the batteries are for the security light system that's where we took this padlock and put it on the furnace switch here so nobody could turn the furnace on while we were in there with all that big giant blowers so they wouldn't eat us alive now it's off we're good, I'll just put it back on my toolbox until we need it. Now we're good. Okay, so now the chiller's filling up. What's it? 5, 27, 13. There we go. Okay. We're done.